Uh, now let's welcome back to the cafe personal stylist Trudy Bennett, who is here to help us with a problem that many of us struggle with, our arms. Morning, Trudy. Good morning. So how many women have an issue with their arms? Which part are we talking about? Loads. Can I just tell you loads and loads? And you'd be surprised. It spans every age, yeah. every size, just women in general really dislike their arms. I'd say probably 80% of the clients I see say, I don't want my arms showing isn't at that all. funny? Well, it's the fedubitas, isn't it? The bit where you can go like that and it goes... Well, blah, blah. it's bingo wings. Yeah. yeah. Bingo! Yeah. And then everything's Fidubitas. still going. Okay. <laughs> yes. Okay. Does it affect what women buy? It does, because a lot of women, because they hate their arms, say, right, I'm not going to buy a top or a dress that's sleeveless. So mm -hmm. it's completely ruled out. So, you know, summer comes and it becomes really difficult for them because they have in their head, I can't wear that, I'm not going to do it, but what I'm here to show, hopefully, is how to problem solve that a bit more. Okay, so what is the solution then? So the solution is layering. And it's sort of, for me, I prefer little shorter layers because that way you can wear them over dresses. They look much better over dresses. Okay. So if you imagine a dress and a longer style layer, just sort of the line of the dress yeah. gets, you know. Can you show us? Yeah, I sure. I need to visualise what you're talking about okay. here. Okay. So here's a wee dress, yeah. which is quite cute and very sleeveless, and a lot of women would go, <gasps> no way, Jose. But instead what we'll do is find a little cropped jacket and we will put that on. And again, because it's cropped, you see, it just sits at the nice waist right. of, the, of yeah. the dress and looks so much better. So if women can have a lot more little cropped layers, I think they can then go forward and, and start buying dresses that they really like, just but because they're sleeveless, they mm. just won't do it. That's lovely. If you were really committed to the cause, though, you'd be like showing us actually putting that on and off. Would I? Yeah. I've got a lot just of, but behind here. I won't and make it. Okay. Here's why we prepared <laughs> earlier. Uh, okay, so that's a really good idea. What else so have you got? Yeah, so that's a great idea for that. And again, I'm going to show it here as well. Well, that's a nice dress. Yes. Little strappy number from the warehouse, actually. Um, and it's, um, again, it's got these little straps. So one thing to remember with straps is that they should stay proportionate to you. So little skinny straps, okay, on sort of a more slender person. And if you're a medium-sized person, medium-sized straps. Okay. It just fits your body better. Right. Okay. I have not, not so much an issue with my arms, but I feel I'm quite broad. So that sort of thing would be good for me too. Exactly. It? See how this top that you've got on today has those medium straps? It just looks fantastic yeah. and you don't look broad. This is because fun. it fits your body beautifully. So what you find is people that are broad or have a larger bust have the skinny strap. The proportions get thrown because you see the larger bust or the wider yeah. If, if you've got that skinny strap. So again, here we go. We've just added a little something over the top so yeah. it doesn't feel like the arms are totally exposed. And that's really nice too because it's actually see-through, so exactly. it's not adding much fabric, is it? So again, what, what I'd like to see women doing is, like I said, buying these little crops, getting layers that are um, like see-through. You can get the meshy ones, you can get the lace ones. So they're nice and lightweight for summer, mm. but they're just making you a little bit more comfortable with your arms being exposed. Fair enough. Another hint is... When you buy a sleeve, if you buy a sleeve like this, see how mine sort of slightly sticks out? Yeah. Okay, so if it sticks out a little bit more, if you create the width in the sleeve, then the arm looks thinner. Oh, okay. okay, it does. So that, that's another hint. What about sort of lengthwise? I know that sometimes when I wear sleeves at a certain length, they really just don't seem to be quite that flattering on me. Now, that's a really good question because the main thing with that is try not to buy sleeves that go straight across, across mm -hmm. okay? Because it does make any arm look a bit sausagey when it's just straight across. Yeah, like Mark Sausage Rolls, perhaps. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, there's an example on screen. <laughs> there's a yeah. big one. <laughs> <laughs> um, the key to it is an angle. Okay. So as we can see on the screen here, as you can see, that straight across, mm. it just looks a little bulkier, okay? And it goes straight across. The other thing that happens when you go straight across is that the eye is drawn to the line of the sleeve and it points at the bust. Right. Now, here we go. We have another lady. Just that little angle. You see how that's just cut on the angle? Yeah. It's just a lot more flattering. Oh, it is nice, isn't it? So if you can find things that are um, have, have your sleeve... It can be short, even if you're uncomfortable with your arms, but as long as it's on that angle, you're actually going to find it's going to look a lot more flattering. So you need to try things on and have a look at how they look on yes, your body. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. And you'll be surprised at the same top going straight across and the, and the same top on an angle. Mm -hmm. That's going to look so much better. Um, one other thing you can do is go with the sheer. That's so, any, nice. you know, okay. these slightly sheerier sleeves. 
are really nice. And that's it's really beautiful. Is that yours? Yes. You bring half your wardrobe into this, <laughs> don't you, Trudy? I would love to come around and visit you one day and see what's in your wardrobe. Well, there's some really good tips there, actually, for people that may be a bit concerned about their arms. I think probably a lot of women, too, are concerned and they don't need to be as well. They I, just I, be... I have to agree. Yeah. Um, Where it I... feels, company, what feels comfortable. Exactly. Yeah. You, you, you do have to do what's comfortable, but you've also got to realise that people aren't looking at your arms. Okay. So, thank you so much, Trudy. A pleasure. Yeah. Always full of great information. Uh, for more, check out on Trudy, check out her website, wardrobeflare.com.